In this video, we're walking through the bustling streets of Tarbriz on an autumn night, starting after 5.30 p.m. from Ser Rari Amin to Char Harari Sharners. By the way, this man is dragging something wrapped in plastic along the ground. A bit unusual to see something carried like this down the street. At this time of year, people don't tend to linger outside. After work, school or university, they usually head straight home to rest. But as you can see, the city is still alive with energy. The warmer clothes people are wearing hint at the cool weather. Tarbriz typically has a cold, dry climate from mid-autumn to the end of winter. As we move along, you'll notice how the night atmosphere adds a different charm to the city. There's a certain calmness mixed with the lively energy of evening activities. Here's Bazari Armat, where in the past, shopkeepers would pull you into their stores, encouraging purchases, sometimes leading to reluctant buys for the shy or reserved. Tonight, though, we're not visiting this market or shopping center and will continue on our way. It's a pleasure to have such wide sidewalks in the older parts of the city, making it great for strolling.
Unfortunately, motorbikes are once again taking over the sidewalks. Seeing people pass by in groups adds warmth and life to the surroundings. It's fascinating to see how each person carries on with their own little routines, some on their way home, others perhaps meeting friends or finishing last minute errands. Here is the sign for Kuche Parsage, it's the alley that's truly worth seeing, which we'll feature in a future video. And here's Cinema 29 Ibarman. I wonder how much it still draws people in this age of the internet and social media. Watching movies in a theater has a unique charm compared to watching them at home. Numerous sports shoe stores lined up here remind us that Tabriz has made a name for itself in shoe production. The beautiful lighting brings a glow to the city, especially during these often dark autumn and winter days. The absence of traffic lights on this fairly wide street is also a bit surprising. It's the season for hot beets, and I wish I could share the delicious aroma with you. This is Melly Shoes, one of Iran's oldest shoe brands. It once had a competitor called Bella Shoes, which unfortunately didn't survive. Street cats, well cared for by the local people, are out and about, too.
This part of the city seems even livelier, with steady foot traffic. Recently, the news has mentioned planned blackheads across Iran, which bring back memories of the Iran-Iraq war years. The architecture here has a story of its own, with buildings that reflect the blend of history and modernity, each corner revealing a unique layer of Tarbriz's character. In a city like Tarbriz, even a simple stroll reveals so much about the lifestyle, culture, and habits of the people. Observing it all gives you a sense of connection to the community. Walking past the different shops and stores, you get a real sense of the local economy and the way people support each other through small businesses and street vendors. The smell of warm street food and the sight of people gathered around vendors create an inviting, cozy feeling in the cool autumn air. It's always interesting to see how cities come to life at night in their own unique ways. Tabriz, with its mix of tradition and modernity, has its own distinct evening rhythm. A street musician playing the handpan adds to the calm and beauty of this autumn night. I hope he gets support from the people passing by. A street vendor is here as well, who knows how many people rely on the income he makes from his sales. Autumn often brings memories of family gatherings, movie nights, popcorn, and hot snacks like roasted beets. But here in 2024, so many things have changed from the past. Once again, a motorcyclist is weaving through the crowd on the sidewalk. Thank <laughs> you. 
Unfortunately, traffic laws in Iran seem to be applied inconsistently, and sometimes even the police struggle to enforce them. People have gotten used to these conditions, and both cars and pedestrians cross the streets together. If online shopping becomes as widespread in Iran as it is in Western countries, many of these shops might inevitably close down, much like what's happened in Western cities, where streets are often lined with chain stores rather than boutiques. Passing by groups of friends and families, you can feel the social spirit here. It's a place where people are close-knit, sharing these spaces together. The lights along the street give the city a warm glow, transforming even the most familiar places into something special after dark. There's something timeless about walking through these streets, as if each building and street corner has witnessed countless stories over the years. The clothing people are wearing also shows that it isn't extremely cold, as some are dressed in lighter layers.
It's also citrus season, with vendors selling tangerines, oranges, and lemons. In about a month, Iranians will celebrate Yelder Night, welcoming winter with watermelon, a tradition that symbolically shows they are unafraid of the cold. Another popular seasonal street food is hot fava beans, served with salt, vinegar, and unique spices, often sold from carts on the sidewalks. We also see lively groups of young people from Tarbriz out and about. Each step on these streets takes us deeper into the evening buzz, where every shop and passerby adds to the story of Tabriz at night. Even the smallest details, from a flickering shop light to a distant laugh, seem to carry a piece of this city's soul. Moments like these remind us how nightfall transforms familiar streets into places filled with mystery and charm. There's something about autumn evenings that brings out a city's personality, the sights, sounds, and even the chill in the air tell their own story. As we walk, you might notice how the steady hum of the city's heartbeat doesn't falter, even as people begin heading home. Thank 
Tabriz's streets are full of little surprises, like the unexpected burst of music from a street performer or the warm glow from a cozy cafe. Looking around, you get the feeling that every corner of the city holds its own secrets, shared only with those who take the time to notice. Nighttime here feels like a gentle invitation to slow down, breathe in the cool air, and appreciate the city in its quiet, natural state. And here is the 1403 statue, marking the current Iranian calendar year. We're now in the eighth month and approaching the Oli Shar citadel area of Tarbriz. The citadel itself is a beautiful sight from afar. And with that, we've reached the conclusion of this video. As our walk comes to an end, I hope this glimpse of Tar Breeze at night has shown you a bit of the city's unique spirit, a blend of warmth, tradition, and energy that fills the air.